Honey Company is cashing in on a growing trend. They say, though they're surrounded by a sea of competition, they've got the best product. Rock Honey reporter Adam Duxter toured the new facility and joins us from our bureau at the Janesville Gazette with the science behind it. Adam? Well, Eric and Charlotte, Simply Solutions is only a couple of years old, but says a scientific process they've perfected has them on the fast track in the CBD market. It looks like a science experiment, partially because it is. We're extracting uh, specific compounds or molecules from plant matter. What you're looking at is the process in which Simply Solutions separates CBD from hemp. Creating a product they say is clean, verifiable, and healthy. Traditionally, that's done by taking the plant matter, uh, submerging it in a chemical uh, to extract those molecules, and then separating the stuff you don't want. But the market around them is growing, says CEO John Getford. Market analysts say CBD products made more than a half billion dollars nationwide last year. And by 2022, that number could grow to 22 billion. Getford says that's led to some ripoffs trying to cash in. There's a lot of CBD products out there now that I question whether there's any CBD in them. But in this lab on Janesville's south side, vacuum bag and then double bag it. That's not the case. There's got to be some government regulation around this and I think the FDA is moving into that space and that's good because we need to guarantee just like in our alcohol that what you're buying is what you're buying. <laughs> But now business is too big for its building. And starting this fall, Simply Solutions is moving into a larger space a mile away. And as the need for additional hemp grows, a potential chance for another Wisconsin profession. We can start deploying on really good soil the best farmers in the country. Uh, and, and what's cool about that is they can sell a crop where they can make some real money again. Now, Gepford says there's no other CBD company in the state of Wisconsin that does what his does exactly the way that they do it. And as the opioid addiction, or sorry, the opioid epidemic continues to grow in the United States, he says alternatives like CBD will only become more popular. Adam, thank you. No, it's